Welcome back to my channel. My name is Maggie. Uh, so today I'm going to Florida. I decided like just two hours ago to try to straighten my curly wig. Now it looks like this. And yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Try to figure this out and I'll see you guys when I get to Orlando. Mm. We are in Orlando right now. Let me tell you all the misfortunes that we've been through today. Starting out, I landed in Orlando. A plane landed in Daytona. Our flight was late for about an hour and a half. So by the time she got to Daytona, they told her the rental, they canceled the rental basically. This morning, we decided to go rent a car. By the time we got to the rental, they told us they were out of vehicles, so we would have to wait. Basically, she would have to give us a call to come back whenever she had any car available. So now we're here at this place. So we finally got a rental. Oh, okay. day? We got a hot dog for four, we got a tiny hot dog, like this and big. Chili, tiny chili. For four dollars, and we split it. Let me call this bubble tea. Dude! We need food! <laughs> We're back at the hotel. We went to this place called Lao Street Food. We paid about $17. We got the pork tapioca dumpling and we got beef jerky and chicken wings. We also got more food. This is Vietnamese place. <laughs> it smells like poop. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys. I kid you not. As soon as we got this food, I started smelling poop. <laughs> I thought she shit us so. <laughs> No, it would have been you. And then was later I realized it was the food we got that actually kind of smelled like poop. This is the food we got. It has noodles underneath and beef and that's the fish sauce plus, you know, veggies. to Miami. I honestly haven't vlogged today because in Orlando we went to the premium outlet mall. It was so hot and we didn't get anything to eat till about 2 o'clock. So I was starving, I was grumpy and I was just not in the mood. We're gonna show you guys our outfit. So Peggy's wearing this two-piece that she got from Shein and her sandals are very basic. <laughs> Excuse me. And I'm wearing just this top that I got from Peggy. She bought it from Forever 21 and a short and my sandals. I got this from um, Asus. <music> Lyft is so cheap around it. We're doing share ride with Lyft and it's like three dollars and we were told that if you ever come to Miami, don't drive except you absolutely have to. Just get freaking yeah, Uber yeah. or Lyft. Yes. Don't. This girl. No <laughs> we got this Miami pass of a coupon. It was about seventy dollars per person, and it gives it gives you an option to do a lot of things within twenty four hours. So basically, Peggy and I are gonna do about three to four things. Probably three, right? Yeah. Probably about three things because we don't have a lot of time to do everything we want to do because we didn't wake up early. I feel like it saves money because if we decided to do any of those things individually, it would cost I'm pretty sure more than seventy dollars. We just finished chapel and this is the aftermath. Look at this shit. Look at my wig. Just look at my look at this. We're not prepared at, at all. Like we should have brought towels. We should have brought I don't know, lotion. <laughs> at least for me. <laughs> up super late because we're supposed to be out of here by 10 and now it's it's noon see the way i'm sweating it's so oh not that but it's so hot and oh. humid we've walked around everywhere but the beach so we decided before we leave today for key west we're gonna uh, take pictures at south beach and then we're gonna grab something to eat and then we're gonna be on our way to key west for this airbnb where we stayed at in miami we paid hundred dollars per night yeah jesus christ <laughs> She booked it, obviously. Guess how much was a key How much? 200 
<laughs> Are you kidding? Seriously, I'm not <laughs> Why am I here? <laughs> oh my god. I'm not even kidding. I didn't know it was this expensive. Are you kidding? No! Let me talk to you. got to Key West. I love this Airbnb. It's different from any Airbnb I've ever been to. Maybe it's the woods. I don't know. I just love the vibe of this room. So I'm kind of low-key jealous of the kind of life people live around here. But like everything is just calm, you know, there's no rush and relaxing. That's the vibe I'm getting here. I haven't even explored yet, but I love this place already. God, that looks so cute. Ooh, that looks good. exploring Key West for about two hours. It's almost midnight right now. This place is so freaking different from Miami. The vibe is completely 110 different. It's so really, I don't know, like how do you even explain it? I feel like Miami is more, it's a lot of tourists and everyone just wants to party and go to the beach and be naked. Here, everyone is in regular clothing. Like I haven't seen anyone in bathing suit besides me and Peggy. <laughs> Good morning. Okay, so we're going to the most southern point. Oh, it's right there. Oh, it's right there. Oh my gosh. We only walked about three minutes from our Airbnb. Look at it. There was a line to take pictures. Everybody was like in a hurry, like take the picture. But now it's freaking raining. So Peggy and I just got to Brandington. We drove about seven hours to get here. Right now, we are at this cute beach house. Peggy's host mom, she uh, works at this, I guess, an, a res an island? I don't know what to call it. She works here, so she got us, she was able to get us a room here. We're gonna be in Brandington all of tomorrow, and the following day, which is on Wednesday, we're going back to Orlando and flying to Austin. <music> I don't know if you guys can hear like the the sound of the ocean. It's so beautiful. It's gonna rain today. Really? Yeah. It's gonna rain? You guys, I'm trying to soak everything all in because we're leaving tomorrow. All the beaches, everything we've been doing, it's just, I just need to soak everything in. And the last thing we're gonna do today, I don't know what we're gonna do. We'll probably just explore this island and Brandonton in general. And just suck it in because tomorrow I'm going back to Austin and Thursday I'm gonna go back to work. It sucks. Can we just live here? But then again, if I live here, I'm just gonna take it for granted. Okay, we're gonna change and I go to the beach. This was where we ate breakfast this morning. raining so we left the beach we bought this burrito three days ago this is gonna be our lunch oh we found out that the room we're staying at it's a hundred and seventy nine dollars per night which honestly is not bad at all for what you get I guess it's cheaper because isn't it's in Bradenton and a lot of people don't come to Bradenton we're gonna meet up for dinner with Peggy's old family We are heading to the airport and 
my vacation is over which is so sad so i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog um subscribe to my channel and like it and like this video if you enjoyed it thanks for watching <laughs> thumbs up thanks for watching bye bye bye, bye.